So you are dying to have LASIK surgery. You make an appointment, you go see the ophthalmologist, and then they tell you you can't have it because you are on Accutane. That is awful. I get it because you are so excited to have it and then you're being told this. Why is that the case? Actually, it's an FDA guideline right now that we ophthalmologists are not supposed to do LASIK when patients are on Accutane. And the reason for this is because Accutane can cause dryness. Hi everyone. So, you know, on this channel, we talk a little bit about eye health since I'm a board certified ophthalmologist. We talk about pediatric vision because I specialize in pediatric ophthalmology and adult strabismus, which is lazy eyes. And we also talk about eye makeup health. So this is a little bit of both because Accutane is obviously used, prescribed by dermatologists for people that have acne. And many individuals are using Accutane now later into their early twenties. And so, this is the age when people start to consider LASIK. You really can't get LASIK younger than age 18. And most LASIK surgeons are going to request that you be over 21. And the simple reason for that is because they want your measurements to be stable. Nearsightedness, also known as myopia, keeps getting worse and worse every year. And we used to think it stabilized, you know, around 1920, but now we're even seeing it get worse into your early 20s. So, when LASIK surgeons, ophthalmologists are about to do surgery, they just wanna make sure that they get the most accurate result for you. They wanna ensure that you have a great outcome. That's also where the whole Accutane thing comes in. So you guys know Accutane is prescribed by dermatologists and it works by decreasing the oil secretion by the oil glands, which is why it helps acne. The thing is it actually also decreases the oil secretion of the oil glands near your eyelids. So right along your lash margin, so where your lashes exit, so you've got about 30 to 40 oil glands there. They make the oil for your tears, so your tears don't evaporate too quickly. So when you're on Accutane, you probably notice that you get really dry eyes. Many people do. You might even get inflammation of your eyelids called blepharitis. And some people can get corneal wound heal healing, which means basically that if you get a scratch on the eye, it just doesn't heal quite as quickly as when you're off Accutane. So these are all reasons that ophthalmologists do not want you to be on Accutane when they perform LASIK surgery because LASIK also causes dry eyes. And if you've got dry eyes from the Accutane, it's just going to exacerbate those underlying symptoms. And it's not going to give you the optimal vision result that you want. You wanna be able to have LASIK surgery remove your glasses and contact lenses and see beautifully. And if you are already on Accutane, that can inhibit that really wonderful outcome. The other thing is the serious dry eyes you get after LASIK surgery, if you're on Accutane, could theoretically inhibit your wound healing of the LASIK flaps. It could cause loss of vision. And again, those are things that you don't want from an elective procedure. And by elective, we mean you know, it's not a surgery that has to be done because you are going blind. It's a surgery you choose to have because you'd like to get out of your glasses or contact lenses, which I understand. I mean, that is exactly why that surgery was created. So most ophthalmologists are going to recommend that you be off Accutane for six months prior to LASIK surgery and six months after. So that's 12 months in total. So you're gonna need to check with your dermatologist to make sure that that's all right for you to do prior to coming into LASIK surgery. Now, here's the thing. There was a really small study done. It was about 130 patients, and they were trying to evaluate if there really was a difference between uh, patients that were on Accutane versus the ones that were not in terms of their visual outcomes after LASIK surgery. And in this study, they didn't find any statistically significant difference. They didn't find anything. They're, the group that had Accutane didn't have a higher rate of infection. They didn't have worse you know, dry eyes. They didn't have worse glare or halos or anything to, to do specifically with the outcomes of the LASIK surgery. So this is not standard of care yet in that if you survey ophthalmologists right now, 100% of them are going to say that they request you to be off the Accutane for at least six months before and six months after. So this is actually an FDA guideline right now that LASIK surgery not be performed in patients on Accutane. 
So as more and more of these studies come out examining the differences, perhaps that guideline is going to be revisited. But for now, check with your dermatologist, make sure you can get off Accutane for at least 12 months. And that's the reason that we don't like to do LASIK surgery when you're on it. So I hope that video was helpful for you guys. If you guys have any more questions about Accutane and LASIK or just Accutane and dry eyes, I can do a whole video on that as well. Drop them in the comments below. Please like, comment, subscribe. I read every comment. I might not be able to answer every single one, but I definitely do read them and try to get to the ones that seem to be the most pressing and the ones that I can answer because it is medical information that I'm giving you guys, I can't provide medical advice. So sometimes I know there are a lot of comments asking specific medical advice, which I can't give, but I can give medical education. So I will see you guys soon. Thanks so much for watching.